excuse me, excuse me, hello, sorry to bother you, I'm Chris, I'm a, I'm a street photographer, and I really like your style. Okay, and you want to take my photograph. Could I take your photograph? That's all right. Thank you so good, because when you looked at me there, I thought, no, this is not going to go well, he's going to no. tell me no. What's your name, by the way? David. David, nice to meet you, David. Thank you, Chris. Do you live in Dublin? For 30 years. 30 years? We well, you haven't lost your accent. Well, which one was I supposed to take up? This is <laughs> nice, isn't it? Have you ever done any modeling before? Not the kind you're thinking of. I'm from New York originally. You're from New York originally. What made you come to Dublin, Ireland, if you don't mind me asking? Um, I did seek artistic asylum. In, in New York, I was terribly attacked by the it's called the IRS. Yeah, I know the IRS, Inland and, Revenue. And they made an example of me, and it was devastating. Do you miss New York? The New York that I missed isn't there anymore. I mean, you can see it in old movies. Yeah. And you could walk around and there were all these remains uh -huh. of the past, of the, the teens and the twenties. I, I came here in maybe 91. 91. So yeah. I saw the tail end of the old Ireland, which was, I miss that. That's been gone for 10 years. And the old people, they're dead now. But when I first came here, the old people were still moving around. It was very okay. good. That I is... like the old people. And there weren't any cafes. And the only restaurants were in hotels. But good luck trying to find interesting people around because they're not. You don't think so? Oh, not. Do you think all. it? And the top of Grafton Street, I'm calling that, you know, Rock and Roll Square now. Rock and Roll is everywhere. You know, it was fine as one part of music. The other music has just been completely suppressed. It's not there anymore. What would be your... My favorite music? Yes. My favorite records? Yes. Popular music of 1926 to about 1935. And I don't like, I don't like swing, but you know, I would definitely take it nowadays. But everything is just being obliterated. Yeah. So you don't like Harry Styles? Well, or, I don't know. What, I don't know what that is. I mean, I'm 72. And when I say the old people have died, and, yeah. and they're not around, they're not yeah. in the streets. They might. There might be some in nursing homes, but they're not around anymore. They kept there from being prostitutes on the bus advertisements. Yeah. You know, because they were still in the world. They had a standard, and they couldn't put prostitutes. It's unbelievable what's what's happening. Tell me this: what makes you happy? What is happiness well, to you? Well, the past makes me happy. You know, if I get some past, you know, get to experience the past. Thank you, David McDermott. That's an Irish name. It's a very good Irish name. McDermott. You know, you meet people that you would think are educated. And then they tell you they haven't read any books. Yeah. I say, what are you reading right now? You're an educated man. Well, it's because I read. If I didn't read, I'd be as stupid as the rest of them. <laughs> All uh, right, Chris. Yeah. Now, it's been, good it's luck been, to it's you. It's been a pleasure. Thank you for saying yes. <laughs> okay. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs>